feelings from the psychedelics, the fun psychedelics, and the more serious, more emotional highs, as well as live experiences. Um, but today I'm just going to share with y'all a quick story about my first LSD trip. Um, it was like, I want to say a month ago, I got into acid. One of my buddies was like, hey man, you want to try some acid with me? I was like, Sure, why not? So I went over to my house, you know, sat down, burned some sage, made it really, really, really great. I put some lights on, and so I popped the acid at 6:45 p.m. and it was 125 UG just now. I had done, I've done pop two more, so around 7 7:15, this when stuff started getting kind of weird. I was really kind of antsy at first, really kind of anxiety feeling. And, you know, my buddy's like, oh, no, bro, that'll pass, that'll pass. So I tried it, and I love it. Like, about 30 minutes after, about 30 minutes after um, 7 is when stuff started getting really weird. Uh, the walls were starting to kind of, like, morph in and out. And started seeing, like, colors everywhere from purple to green to blue. And it was, it was really kind of an emotional situation. I was happy. And then... That's when I was faced with reality. I had been stuck in front of who I really was, and at that time it was just scary. I was kind of, kind of uptight and always stressed about the smallest things. So it would show me that me is that person. So, and take take my advice when you're doing acid. Make sure that you're in the right state of mind because it's it's one of those fuck you drugs. They don't care about about how you feel until you let yourself out, you meditate, you make sure you're in a good environment. If you're tripping with somebody, make sure it's somebody you trust with your entire life because that'll be your trip guide. So that was that was a pretty emotional experience. I was happy, and the next morning, you know, I felt like dirt, you know, smoked a couple dabs, and just kind of chilled out and took a breather. And my advice to anybody who wants to try psychedelics, I'd say just do it. Like, don't even think about it. Just do it because if you think too hard about it, you're really going to put yourself in a state of mind of worrying because you're worried about the outcome of the drug. Don't even worry about it. Just let the acid take its its tour and make your body just relax as possible. Um, Sorry, I'm really I'm pretty high right now. I actually smoked a couple blunts earlier. But besides that, I would say that psychedelics have really changed my life so far. And I plan on uploading a live experience myself. I plan on doing it probably the next week or two, um, so it's gonna be it's gonna be pretty dope. So subscribe to my channel, um, like this video, give it two thumbs up because eventually I'm gonna I'm gonna get a lot better with editing and it's gonna be pretty pretty dope. So right now I'm working with just my phone until I get a camera. So just 